Hello everyone and welcome back to another series of the interviews we have at Focus Gaming News. Today we have with us Mirela Agatornovic, who is the product manager for EGT Interactive. Mirela, welcome to our series of interviews. How are you doing? Fine, thank you and thanks for your invitation. No problem. So we'll start, so you know what we'll um, talk about today. We'll talk a bit about EGT Interactive. We'll talk about what, um, about some of the strengths that you have as a developer, your future plans and a couple of your product titles. So we will talk about in the beginning, the Burning Kino game. What do you think it adds to your roster and how do you think it modernizes the whole sub vertical of Kino gaming? Uh, so what we're trying to do here with our Burning Kino game is to have a better user experience and to offer user-centric features. Uh, while the user is playing uh, Burning Kino, uh, they get the feeling of a real-time game because of the draw that we're providing every 30 seconds. Game could be played actually with uh, 1 to 10 uh, numbers and uh, the player is getting payout based on how many numbers uh, they're playing with. Additionally, uh, we are uh, providing uh, real-time uh, ticket sorting, fast access to code and hot numbers, and uh, instant rebet functionality. And we're having another one key feature, uh, which is when the user is playing with more than seven numbers, the user is um, can be paid out even when there are no matched numbers. And we can call this uh, win when there is no win. So quite a lot there to digest. And what were the, so when you decided to come up with this game, what gaps did you see in the market? So where do you think this is going to have an upper hand on the competition, if you like? Uh, we are trying to be always ahead of the competitors. So uh, with this game, we managed to uh, streamline our lessons learned and uh, to provide a better user experience and a modern game with a what replay style. I mean, it must, of course, like fit into the broader business perspective in that sense. So where do you think that in terms of like your overall gaming offerings, how big of a role do you think that this will play in it? Uh, hopefully it's uh, going to be uh, quite a success. Uh, of course, we built all the features there uh, with um, regards to the uh, competitors and uh, additionally we're hoping that uh, we are entering a niche that we're going to have quite a success okay and with regards to kino as well do you think that it's still a um so do you think that there's still like a lot of room for improvement in the industry that because it's not like say for example on the same it's not as popular as for example slot games and things like that so do you think that's because there aren't enough quality products or because the players on don't this have is, the knowledge this is completely uh, true uh, and uh, here came uh, our uh, challenge and it was to build a um, better game with the better features keeping the classic uh, lottery game flow so uh, i believe that uh, we managed to achieve that okay and what more can we expect from egt as a supplier or developer we're having a completely new title, uh, which release date is uh, right around the corner, and it's called the five uh, lot of five outer thirty five, with additional six ball draws. So uh, hopefully we can uh, speak about this next time. So and tying in a little bit with your future plans as well. So you've recently started making more of a presence in Latin America. You of course already have a strong presence in Europe as well. With regards to other parts of the world, are there any other places you're thinking about extending your presence into, or do you plan on mainly focusing on your current market strongholds? Our plans are, of course, uh, about expanding. So once um, all of that is uh, true, so uh, we can um, be the first to know that we're going to let know. And as a developer, what would you say that your biggest strengths are overall compared to your competitors in the market? Uh, I believe that we are quite popular and uh, del in delivering um, top-notch uh, slot games. Mm -hmm. So this is uh, our first trend. And of course, the lessons learned that we are having over the years and uh, how we managed to interpret them and uh, in developing new games. 
Okay, so Morela, thank you for being with us today. Is there anything else that you'd like to add on top of what we've already discussed? First of all, thanks a lot for your invitation once again. And the only thing that I want to add is just that I'm hoping that the game is going to have um, quite success. And of course, it's going to be a um, great opportunity for the operators to reach out to new audience. Uh, and to increase uh, retention rate and player commitment. Sounds good. And of course, we wish you all the best with that one as well. So that was Mirela Agatonovic, the product manager of EGT Interactive. Thanks a lot for being with us today on this latest of the Focus Gaming series of interviews. And we look forward to speaking to you next time. Many thanks and good luck. Thank you.